example, husband and wife were not talking because they had a problem. So no speech. Husband says, not talking to you. So wife tries. She says, please forgive me. I, you know, I was weak. What I did was wrong. Not talking to you. Okay. Now what happened is it lasted for about two days. And after that, the man had a very, very important appointment. He had a flight to catch at six o'clock in the morning. So he leaves a note on the bed of his wife saying, I have a very important meeting. Can you please get me up at five o'clock? The note was on the pillow. So when she came to bed, there's no speech between them. So she looks at the note, nods her head. She put the note away. Anyway, the man got up at 10 o'clock in the morning. <gasps> the sun is out, everything happened. What happened? My wife did not wake me up and she's gone to work already. He was so angry and upset, but there was no speech between them. Anyway, he went, ran downstairs quickly into the kitchen and put his tea, the water to boil, and he notices a note on the table saying, darling, it's five o'clock. <laughs> note on the table, meaning I was here waiting for you. I, there was no speech, I wrote it down. You wrote it for me, I wrote it for you. Okay, this obviously is a joke, but the truth is the lesson we learn from it is lack of communication causes big, big issues. Issues that are bigger than the issue we stop talking for. You know that? Why did, why did you stop talking to each other? Why do you have a problem? Sort it out. Speak to each other. Be realistic. You will solve, solve your matter. If you are unrealistic, you know, I know of people who get married and they, the man thinks I'm going to change her overnight. Brother, you won't change her besides only her clothing. And that too, maybe she might not want to change. May Allah safeguard us. You won't change anything. She will change on her own. But you need to understand who she is. She's a human being. She also has an upbringing. She has people whom she loves. She has perhaps brothers and sisters or a family, parents and so on. She has an upbringing. She has Allah and a link with Allah that might be different from yours in terms of strength or weakness. But you need to understand she's not going to change overnight for you. No. And even the other way around, sometimes people get married and they think, a woman thinks, don't worry, this guy, I'm going to change him just like this. You know, I'll change him just like that. You don't change a man just like that. It doesn't happen. You need to be realistic. They have an upbringing so much that they've come with that's engraved. You will need to slowly and surely work with love and care and understand that the change will come after some years if it is going to come. And if you're lucky, you might have a, a sooner than that change if you're fortunate. But let's get rid of this attitude that I'm going to change, I'm going to change. Download our mobile applications or register on our official website to get access to exclusive content. Links given in description of video.